Everybody wants to be a cat Because the cat's the only cat Who knows where it's at Ooh, here go. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be um, filming the Disney Parks tag. So it's a different tag from the first one I did. It's basically all about the Disney Parks and I've only been to Disney World personally. So that's what I will be referring to when I answer these questions. Hopefully I'll get to go to Disneyland soon, but I'm not really sure. So until then, it's gonna be Disney World, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get started. What is your favorite ride in each park? Okay, so for Magic Kingdom, um, I would have to say either Ariel's Under the Sea Adventure or the Haunted Mansion. It's really hard for me to choose between the two, but I really like both of them. The cemetery at Haunted Mansion is pretty much my favorite thing, so if the ride stops in the cemetery, I'm perfectly fine with it. I don't complain. I'm happy. There's music, and I love it. In Epcot, I think my favorite would have to be Soren. That's the first thing we try to get a fast pass for whenever we get there, so... I love it a lot and I can't wait, oh my gosh, I can't wait until I do Soarin' Over the World. It's gonna be awesome, awesome. In Animal Kingdom, I think my favorite is definitely Cali River Rapids. I used to not like it because I was very self-conscious about like getting wet and then walking around the parks or something, I don't really know. But I went last summer in June and I wrote it and let's just say that I was completely drenched. Like, there is no denying it. I was soaking wet. I love it a lot. And my favorite ride in Hollywood Studios, and probably my favorite ride in Disney World, like, overall, is the Hollywood Tower of Terror. I love it so much. It's my dream to work there, so I got hired for attractions, and I'm keeping my fingers crossed. If I got to work at Tower of Terror, and I got to be a bellhop, I would just, I would be beside myself. I would, I don't even, yeah, mm. See, I can't even make words. Like, what is, I don't, what? Uh, but I really want to work there like really bad <sighs> It's my favorite. So if you love Tower of Terror and you want to ride it with me Let me know. What is your favorite restaurant in Disney? I like food a lot But if I was saying food and atmosphere as a whole So basically the whole big picture of a Disney dining experience I would have to say Crystal Palace because I like their food it's pretty good I love seeing the characters in the morning and I love it when Eeyore comes to your table and it just makes you really happy and also Chef Mickey Chef Mickey's is really good so if you haven't been there it's a lot of fun um, I don't know if they do it anymore because I haven't been in like a long time but they used to have like this cupcake station and you could make cupcakes with Goofy and that was a lot of fun so if they still do that definitely check it out what is your favorite in-park show? This one is so easy for me because it's my obsession. I like to go at least twice when I'm in the park. The Festival of the Lion King is my favorite. It's so beautiful and oh my gosh, like it gives me goosebumps and I normally cry when I'm watching it. It's kind of a big deal. What is your favorite parade in the park, past or present? I have not seen the Festival of Fantasy Parade yet, which I'm dying to see, like dying to see. I'm so excited. but. If I had to pull from all of my past trips to Disney, I would say that the Spectro Magic Parade in Magic Kingdom was my favorite. Oh my gosh, it was so beautiful. They do the electrical parade now, which is still really pretty, but um, the Spectro Magic Parade was all white lights. So everything was just like white and glowing and beautiful and I loved it a lot. What is your favorite holiday to spend at Disney? I have actually only ever been to Disney for three holidays. I've been for 4th of July, I have been for Christmas, and I have been for New Year's. And I would have to say that New Year's Eve was my favorite thing ever to celebrate at Disney. It was the most incredible experience. We stood behind the Cinderella castle instead of um, right in the hub during the fireworks. So we literally had like a 360 view. We were just completely 100% surrounded by fireworks. Wow, I was crying. <laughs> like, I was crying a lot. It was... Yeah. What is your favorite snack to eat in each park? I wouldn't say that I have one specific favorite in each park, but overall in the Disney parks, Mickey Premium Ice Cream Bars. Like, <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing how many I eat when I go to Disney, but we'll just like, 
keep that little on the DL, you know? Like, we don't have to know all that. And also, I really like, you know those cute little um, Mickey Head Rice Krispie treats? But the ones that are made with fruity pebbles and then are dipped in that, like, flavored white chocolate. Oh, Lord. They're so good. Oh, my favorite. I love them so much. I've never um, had the one that's, like, covered in caramel and then is, like, dribbled, drizzled in chocolate, but it looks really good. So I want to try that one next because I love Rice Krispies. Yum. What is your favorite memory from your last trip to Disney? The last time I went to Disney um, was with my best friend, Andrew, and basically that whole trip was a favorite memory. So I'm actually going to go back to the one before that, which was my trip um, for this New Year's. We were sitting in the hub, and it was, oh my goodness, it was so crowded because we had just, um, they had just finished the parade, so there was like that about an hour and a half rush of people moving around in front of the castle and everything. Well, we happened to get like really close to the castle, which was exciting because I was super excited to watch Wishes. And there was a family from Canada. There was um, a man, his wife, and then their daughter who was six years old. And she was adorable, first of all but it was her first time at Disney, and so I got to stand next to her while she was watching Wishes for the first time, and Wishes is like my favorite spectacle to behold at Disney besides the Osborne lights, and it's just, it was amazing to watch her face when she was watching Wishes for the first time. I just, wow, it was awesome. Buses or monorail? This is kind of a weird question because the monorail doesn't go everywhere, but um, if I would have to say which one is more fun, I would say the monorail. I don't know why, I just like being on the monorail. It makes me feel like I'm in the Jetsons or something. I don't know, but it's kind of cool. But the buses take you everywhere, so buses? I don't know, both? Is that, a, is that an answer? Both? What is your favorite section slash land in Magic Kingdom? I love Fantasyland. I love it. I love going to Ariel's Grotto. I cry every time I meet her. Ariel's Castle is beautiful. Um, I'm super excited for the Mineshaft ride to open up. Um, I just love Snow White. Uh, she's adorable. But if I had to say my favorite land or section in Magic Kingdom, it would have to be Main Street USA. There's just something so special about when you first walk in the parks and you see Cinderella's castle at the end of Main Street and it's just like, oh, so much emotion, so many tears. You walk in and you're like, I have arrived. You know how the guy is like walking around with the big balloons that have the Mickey head inside of them? I don't really know what those are called, but oh my gosh, I just love it. What is your favorite country to visit in the World Showcase? They all have really good food and they're all very well themed, which is awesome. If I had to say my favorite, I think it would be Morocco because it's super cool. I love the music and I love the way everything looks. Like it looks very authentic. I f literally feel like I have just gone into a different place when I'm in Morocco and Epcot and I love it. Who is your favorite character to see in the parks? Alice is my favorite, so anytime I get to see her, I am beside myself with joy. But also, Marie from the Aristocats, I love to see her. She's adorable, and when she's life-size, she is just perfect. If you could only go on one ride in any park all day, what would it be? This one's easy for me because it's my favorite ride in all of Disney, like I said previously. Hollywood Tower of Terror. If you're scared of it, ride it once. You need to ride it once. It's awesome. I love it. It's very well themed. And then if you haven't seen the movie that Disney produced after the ride, you need to see it because it's really good. And then last but not least, one thing you have to do in the parks. If there was only one thing that I could choose, I would say you really need to see a parade. Go to a parade and enjoy it. Do that. And if you're there for Christmas time, please go see the Osborne lights. I mean, please. Like, they're super beautiful and it'll pretty much change your life. And no, I'm not being dramatic. I'm being serious. All right, guys, that's all I have for you this time. Um, I think the next video I film will probably be part two of my bucket list because it has grown substantially over the past few days. So until then, have a magical day.